Hey guys, we're back here in Northern Ontario in the Algoma region. Today we have the second generation Ion G2 Ice Auger. We're going to be reviewing this while we're out on the, on the lake today. Um, our goal today is we're using the Aqua View and we're going to go look for an old sunken boat. That's on one of the lakes here that we've been to. We've used this ice auger a couple times before and we caught four lake trip while using it. So we're gonna test it out. So we're late season, we want to be careful, but we still have, as you can see, obviously quite a bit of ice. There is uh, still four or five inches right off shore, so we're pretty good. We have the aqua view here. We'll be uh, testing that out today. Turn it the other way a little bit. Right, stop there. You know, that kind of does look like a big piece of wood. Really? Which way is it though? When you pull it up exactly straight. So that way, to that way. Huh. And to the right, so over there. Okay, we'll try some over there. Just a bit more. Cool. There, if you want to see. Yeah, we could try it further that way. So far, we've uh, yeah. seen some rocks and a big, looks like a pretty big, uh, maybe old cedar tree or something. Let's try a couple more holes. That looks like a boat, kind of. That looks like a boat there. It's not very clear. There it is. Yep, you can see both sides. That looks like it. So we tried this hole, which I marked with a star. That way we could see the back of the boat. We tried over there. You can see kind of the front. A bit more. I can't tell if it's a rock or if that's the front of the boat. Lift it up a little higher. A little bit higher. Hoping this one will get it. So far, we have about five or six holes over there, another five or six in this direction, and then uh, four over this way. 
and the uh, Ion Ice Auger, or the, yeah, the Ion G2 Ice Auger is still going proud here. Keep trying. There we go. That's too much. Right there, we see the front of the boat. Then spin it more left, just slowly. Yeah, that's it. We've got a couple angles of it now. Cool. So we've used this ice auger on other lakes. Um, we've used it when we caught four different lake trout on one of the backcountry lakes in this area. It's worked really good then, it's working really good now. Way faster obviously than a hand auger and uh, more convenient than a uh, gas auger. Weighing only about 17 pounds, it uh, is really light. It has a fairly flimsy material to it, or at least it appears, but from how many uses it gets, it works really good. Um, it's uh, priced somewhere around $1,200 on Amazon, so it's uh, pretty expensive, but if you're an avid fisherman, you probably want to use this along with the uh, Otter Ice Hut or something like that. I'm going to get back to the aqu Aqua View and see if we can find that boat. Yeah, so this one marked by two X's, you can see the front of the boat over here. It looks to be right on the boat. We'll give her a spin. Um, right, maybe. Yeah, you can see the side of it there, eh? Uh -huh. And the other boards. A bit more. Looks like we're kind of in the boat right there. I want to lift it up a tiny bit. There we go. And back left. So you can just kind of see planks. A couple planks around there. That might be the side of the boat possibly right there. Hard to tell completely. Well, the ions are working good. We've got approximately 20 holes. Yeah, that's really good. Approximately 20 holes and easy. Yeah, maybe right where you are. That one should have seen it, or those four should have seen it better, or maybe some of those ones should have seen it better. <laughs> okay guys, we're going to take off because uh, storm's coming along down that way. Um, if you like this video, check out some of the other videos. I also review the Ion R1 ice auger, and uh, I have some ice fishing videos and canoe and camping videos that we do in the summer too. So check those out. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Check out the channel for all sorts of outdoor videos, including wildlife and canoe trips.